my continuous series of going over software that I personally use and would recommend. This time I'm going over the Encrypto software and this one is also by MacPaw just like the Clean My Mac, Clean My PC software. The good thing about this one is it's, it is totally free. You don't spend a dime on this one. They give it to you free and it's a good program for encrypting your uh, files. You know, it encrypts the, with a password with a AES 256 encryption, which is very high and very good. So this is the program I'm talking about. It's called uh, Encrypto. And just click through it here right quick. You'll see that it says embedded password hint. So you can actually uh, put a hint in there when you actually make the file and encrypt it. So when somebody uh, receive it, they know what the password is. You can just send them a hint so they can remember. Then it has, uh, we, like I say, you can share the file, send it through email, messenger, or, you know, any other way. And you can also hide the file, but I think you need an extra program for this one. Yeah, the hider, too, to actually hide that file. It's an extra program, and I think that's a paid program. This program that actually works on Mac and Windows, so you have access to it on either version so if you made a file on Windows like a spreadsheet file or a document file or even a photo or anything you can send it to somebody who have a Windows machine and they'll be able to open that file by just entering the password that you use to encrypt the uh, file this is the program right here all it's asking you to do either drop a file or add a file so you can actually grab a file off your system and then just drop it on this little yellow box right here or you can actually add a file by clicking the plus button and it will bring up the inspector and you'll see it actually says hey do you want to add the file here so if I say yes I choose this file and then it says okay here you go here's the file what is the password do you want to put with this file and I just type in a password you can choose to show it and then you can put a hint to the password if you send it to somebody and you can say and you just click encrypt and then it will just see it's going through the process of encrypting that file and it's all done so I can share this file via email or save it as a file on my computer so if you're not using your built-in email system already and you want to send it to like Gmail or Outlook or anything like that, the best thing to do is actually save the file and then use it as an attachment. So if I click save, it asks me where do I want to save it and I can save it anywhere. I just save my desktop for now. And that file is actually ready to go. And this is the file. I just drag it on the screen so you can see what it is. But this is what it looks like. And this file is encrypted now. So that's basically how the program works. And if I want to start over, I just click start over. And this time I'm going to drag a file in, like a picture file. And you'll see it says, uh, do you want to put the password with it? And the same process. So it doesn't matter if it's a picture file. It's just files that you want to encrypt where you don't want somebody else to get eyes on it only that particular person that you're trying to send the file to it'll encrypt that file for you and you can send it to anybody that you want to with that password you can send them a hint or a no hint but they're the only one will be able to open that file because like I said it is password protected and it won't let nobody else open it until they enter the password so now that I have the file encrypted I can go to the process of opening that file but like I said, I would need a password. So this is what the the other party would get if you send the file to them, like in an email attachment or anything like that. This is what they would see. And once they uh, click on it, now they would have to have the program installed on their computer, the Encrypto, which like I say, it's a free program for Mac and Windows. So all I have to do is just install the software and they'll be good to go. 
But once they receive the file, it looks just like this. And then all they have to do is just double click on it. And then, like I said, it has the hint. And if you don't put a hint, there won't be no hint. But here's the password you'd have to put in to open that file. And then I would hit decrypt and it's actually taking off the encryption of the file and now I'm able to open the file. So it's that simple, it's that easy. So from this point you can save the file to your document or desktop or wherever you want to save it to. And this will be the encrypted version, open version once you save it. And I just dragged it on the screen so you can see exactly what it looks like. This is the encrypted version. Of course, you know, you can reveal the file and it will actually show you where it is. This is what it looks like encrypted and this is what it looks like unencrypted. So that's, like I said, that's a nice, neat little program I wanted to just run a quick video on. If you are looking for a program where you want to send secure files without anybody prying eyes on it, I would recommend this program. I use it and I'm recommending it to you. Alright, well, I hope you like this video. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one.